Hi, my name is Stephen McGee, and I'm the author of Curing Electromagnetic Hypersensitivity. And we're going to talk about the subject of electromagnetic hypersensitivity. And that is cell phone towers. And the cell phone tower we're looking at right now is west of my home. And it's a little bit different to where it was a few months back, in the sense that there's only one set of transmitters on the top of it. And there used to be another set of transmitters around the middle of that tower, and they've now gone. And I believe that is in response to complaints that I submitted to the FCC in the USA and Health Canada in Canada. And what I actually found was that this cell phone tower was actually causing extensive plant retardation, both inside my home and outside of my home. And I'm going to show you some of that plant retardation that is occurring. So let's go and take a little walk around my garden. I'm going to take the camera off the tripod. And we can see what's going on. So one of the things that I actually inadvertently did was that wall over there had vines planted along it. And this is what alerted me to the fact that it was the radiation coming from that cell phone tower that was causing all of my problems in the garden. Now all of these plants in the garden show extensive retardation compared to plants elsewhere. And it was only after many years of observing the plants in this garden and the distinctly different behaviours regarding growth compared to other parts of the garden that I actually realised that it was the cell phone tower that was behind those trees. I'm quite fortunate in the fact that I do actually have some trees between me and the tower because that helps attenuate the energy. But as you can see we've got a very barren wall here and that changes as we move out of the line of sight of the cell phone tower. So right around here is where we start getting the vigorous growth. Now it's all the same types of vines that are planted along this wall. There's no difference between the species. They're all purchased and planted at the same time. And the only difference I see is that right out there there's a cell phone tower behind those trees. And as we move out of the view of the cell phone tower, we actually find that we get this vigorous plant growth rate. And I've seen this retardation throughout the back garden. And it doesn't appear across the plants in other parts of the garden. It was very uniform along this wall between being in sight of the tower and being out of sight of the tower. So what we're going to do is we're actually going to watch these vines over the coming years and we're going to see how they change now that that transmitter has disappeared off the cell phone tower. And as soon as I have any more information I will do another video. I hope you enjoyed the video and I wish you the very best of health. Thank you.